You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Megan Knight with your WMAR 2 News update. Millions of dollars is going towards removing lead out of water pipes in neighborhoods around the state. The Department of the Environment is spending $80 million to do this. Baltimore City is getting a little over $21 million of that funding. Baltimore County will be getting about $6.5 million. Lead can cause brain damage and harm a child's nervous system and development. A water main break caused a lot of damage to cars parked in a neighborhood in Windsor Mill. Thousands of gallons of water shot out of the ground like a geyser on Courtley Drive and rocks smashed windows in cars. Now that pipe has now been fixed. Public works crews will be back out there to repave the street and also replace curbs. And now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Happy Monday, Maryland. We're dealing with cloudy skies today, and also those showers will linger into the afternoon, but they will be very intermittent and very light. Nothing like what we dealt with over the weekend. Highs today will take a hit. We only rise into the upper 60s, so it will feel kind of similar to how it felt yesterday. Mid 60s on Tuesday, so Tuesday is actually looking to be the coolest day out of the next several days, and some of those showers could spill over into the day tomorrow. So keep the rain gear on standby over the next couple of days. We are looking drier as we head into your Wednesday, but still staying below normal back in the 70s later this week and then more sunshine this weekend with highs in the mid 70s. All right, thanks Stevie and stay with WMAR2news.com for updates to stories throughout the day and for your news and weather while you're out and about. You can always download the WMAR2news app. Thanks for watching. I'm Megan Knight.